What's up, nerds? So, you know, as the voice of raiding content in Old School RuneScape, I kind of wanted to make a video talking about all of the raids, you know? Um, I wanted to make a tier list, you know, ranking each one of them. And we we have a lot of raids in this game, so I think it may take a while to get through, but let's cut to live. Okay, so we have all of our selections here. Again, this might be one of my longer videos, but I think that's okay, and I think that's worth it. We'll start with Chamber of Zarek, you know, it was the first raid Jagex made, you know. They didn't do everything perfectly. Um, you have to scout and spend more time looking for the perfect raid than actually doing the content. And that kind of sucks. But once you're doing the content, it's pretty good. Uh, you, may, you may have to glitch out the boss to actually have fun doing it by running the head. But I think it's pretty interesting, you know. But maybe that's just me. It also has some Candyland-ass puzzles in it. And... That's not fun. What is the guardian or crab room? Those aren't fun. Uh, I don't know what the puzzle is in tightrope, but it's pretty cool. With that being said, I'll put it in A. Yeah, it's an A tier raid. Next, we have Theater of Blood. Now we're talking. That's that's a raid. This is a raid, I should say. You know, I think it's got a lot of depth. I think it has a lot of fun things you can do, and you feel pretty rewarded when you complete the content. It's awesome. It also has no puzzles, you know? We're not playing Candyland or Monopoly. We're actually doing combat and a combat-focused thing, which is raiding. So for that, I want to put it in S. But but actually, I think it's pretty unfriendly to newer players, and it's hard to get into. And they have mechanics that aren't great for these newer players. Uh, so for that reason, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put it in A. Yeah, it's it's an A tier raid. All right, now we got Tombs of a Mask, Jagex third raid. They got lessons from the last two. That's pretty good. They have this invocation system. You get to change things up. Even though there's like 50,000 invocations, none of them really meaningfully change the raid. Uh, mm, uh, with that being said, it's still fun. It's a great stepping stone for players getting the raiding content. And again, the mechanics may be super rigid, so you can't try out new things. But there is the butterfly method, and that's kind of fun. Um, it has puzzles in it, and they suck. And the Baba puzzle makes you want to quit the game. But it's still fine. I still think it's a good raid. I think they telegraph attacks well. It's very, the clarity is great. Uh, yes, I'll, I'll put an A tier. A tier for sure. Okay, I, I guess that's the video. I thought this might have taken longer, but, you know, that's it. See ya. Bye.